Hey guys, this crypto Marie, she does it all, a little bit of everything. I'm going to give you the latest on how the crypto market is doing. I just checked my portfolio. My lady's still doing fantastic, 15% up. And I've seen every other coin that I have on my portfolio are green right now, doing amazing. The only one I saw that was red was MM Finance. Again, I am so happy to see my ladies stay up, even all the doubts or the you know non-coverage they give my ladies my ladies still up and on the top 10 gainers for today i'm really really happy to say that uh i was watching one of the youtubers that was uh complaining on pepe's volume goes down and of course you've seen so many uh, thumbnails saying is Pepe dead? Can you still become millionaire with Pepe? Let me tell you guys something, a reality check. As you all know, if you've been watching my channel for the past year and a half, I have always let you guys know how I feel about a certain things. And I don't bullshit around. I let you know straightforward what's good. And the biggest problem we have right now, I even take notes on what to say. I know it's late at night time. I can't, <laughs> yeah, no, I can't read my own handwriting, but I'm going to do my best because I'm going to do a call out on all those big YouTubers that's supposed to be focusing on Pepe, Shiba Inu, Elon Douglas Mars, uh, Tonic Tectonic, because those are the usual coins we talked about all the times but now we have this big the thing that i don't understand those youtubers have some of them have a, a hundred and ninety something thousand subscribers 200 and something 58 um not to be exact i mean i'm talking about people that have one point something million if not it's big 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 you know group of people subscribe to them so if you want pepe volume to stay up to be up to date you have to mention pepe you have to have videos on pepe i feel like youtubers now are like um flower picker you know pick a flower they say it in spanish they pluck this flower they let it go and try another flower let it go it's like they trying every coins that come to the market how can you stay up with the Joneses when you skip one and go to another, skip one, go to another? I feel like they don't even care about building up community anymore or building up volume or, or, or cap market cap anymore. It's like, okay, let's see which new coins we can make money from. Now, the big YouTubers that I am talking about, I'm not going to mention name because I do have respect for them. We, we are trying the best we can to bring people to our channels to watch. But sometimes when you do too much, it's just ridiculous. I will not be mentioned name, but I'm going to mention the name that they are covering, uh, covering right now. I'm going to mention the name of the coins that they are advertising right now, that they are promoting right now. It is just ridiculous. Pepe has not been around not even for two months. It seems that like we already given up on Pepe, which is not right. Okay. Now they're talking about Ben Crypto. They're talking about Elmo. They're talking about We Found. I mean, when I see stuff like that, it's like, oh my God, what a, what, what? Those people are traders, you know? They're going for the next big thing. And another word I hate to use. Is this the next Shiba Inu? Is this the next Pepe? Why do we have to have a next, 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 next? Can it just be the coin doing fantastic by itself on its own without even Elon Musk? I know a lot of people love Elon Musk. He make the coin go double, triple with a tweet. Things can change financially for a lot of people. But at the same time, once he do that, he just dropped the coin. So if the coin doing amazing by itself, why do we need Elon Musk, you know? Why are we hoping for him to tweet something so the coin can skyrocket? It just doesn't make any sense. Sorry. So now, we need to go back on focusing on building community. 
building trust because we have so many new coins coming in the market every five seconds it's just disgusting to see and then we have big youtubers falling for the trap you are falling for it little by little we turn our back on shiba you know we turn our back on elon Douglas and mars we turn our back on some good coins that actually have a future but because ben uh we found elmo those coins supposedly are the one with the hype right now you dump pepe what happened to building pepe up uh, another thing um i was watching you see i have my own youtube channel i do my best to bring the latest on crypto celebrity athletes whatever it is that i find important i bring it to you guys but at the same time i find it pretty interesting to watch other people's point of view another thing i heard is oh god i think i lost my thought on that one i had it in my mind for some reason it just gone for one second again let's go back probably I, I go back to what i was supposed to be saying i forgot for one second again we have to focus focus yeah what i was gonna say i bring the thought back i was watching somebody that was saying this pepe coin has nothing to do with the old pepe they had created for mac Fury. are you out of your mind are you losing your mind right now? Give me a break. I know you don't want to hear the word sewing, pulling back. But let me tell you something. Like I said before, if you guys don't want Pepe to be work pull or take out of the market, these creators better have some kind of conversation with Mac Furry. Because this man was the initial creator of Pepe. I don't care in what language you said it to me. I would not believe this Pepe is a different Pepe. This frog is the same frog that was created in the 2000s. So if you were going to do a Pepe, you would at least change the color. <laughs> change the color. Change the way the frog look. Have a different animal, a different insect, a different type of species. You bring the same green pepe. Now you're going to try to make me believe it is not the pepe from Mac Furry creation? You're out of your mind. And you think Mac Furry is going to believe that bull crap? He sued two people before. I don't think it's anything for him not to sue a third time. Since we love pepe, I think we should all get together and do the right thing and ask this man, hey, what do you need from us? We love your creation. We have made something out of it. Before you planning to sue us, before you planning to have it work pool, what can we do to help you financially? Because at the end of the day, that was his thoughts in paper. That was his thoughts in creation. You cannot think you're gonna come over, make some mean coins out of it, and then not give him some kind of recompense financially. It's just ridiculous, okay? Again, let's go back to big YouTubers promoting i don't know some of them do get paid some of them don't some of them hide it but like today there were three big youtubers and i like to watch their live streams but they are promoting we found they are promoting coins that i really don't care for okay right now in my portfolio i have shiba inu i have pepe and i sacrifice so much to accumulate as much pepe as i can i have my ladies I have Tectonic, Elon Douglas on Mars, a little bit of um, MM Finance, a little bit of Gala. I get rid of a lot of my coins that was just sitting there like a turtle to get some Pepe. So my hope and dream was to have Pepe listed at Coinbase so we can, you know, actually get some money. Somehow we're still waiting, hoping we don't know what's going to happen. Why don't we all have a petition, have people sign it to have Pepe list on Robinhood and Coinbase, okay? Instead, we are going, jumping one coin to the other, promoting, advertising different coins and forget about Pepe that just been listed. What are you doing? What are you doing? Last week, Pepe volume was triple the volume of Shiba Inu and Dogecoin combining. Our dreams and hope is to have Pepe to hit one penny. It is in my own 
well-being and everybody else who invested in Pepe to see it get there. But instead, we jump one coin to the other and 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 have all these nonsense coins that might be work pool, that might not be around for long. We're talking about Ben, we're talking about Elmo, we're talking about we found These coins come out of nowhere. It's like we hyped it up, get some money, next. We hyped it up, get some money, next. It just it's just ridiculous. As an investor myself, slash YouTuber, slash influencer of cryptocurrency, I am exhausted. I am tired. I am like, at, look, perfect example. My lady has been doing amazing since yesterday. None of those big YouTubers mention my ladies. They focus on something else. My ladies have a chance of survival. 30 something million dollar in, uh, in, in volume. I think this is next to Pepe been doing amazing. Of course, not the same amount in volume, but at least you see a lot of people love my ladies. Why don't we all focus, talk about those coins, build a community for them, and see where it can take us. But no, we want to talk about some nonsense crap that could be work pull. And I'm so disappointed of my colleagues, of my uh, uh, fellow YouTubers that fall for the trap. You know, I really don't know if they've been paid for those, but it's just ridiculous. It's just ridiculous. I'm trying to read my notes because... I had to write stuff down. Yeah. Uh, the Those big YouTubers' behavior are like little kids opening Christmas gift. Okay, this is a new coin. Ha <laughs> ha. Open it. Happy. Go to the next one. Ha ha ha. Happy. Next one. Ha. It's like you have to focus, you know. You can't be jumping left, right, all over the place. It's just ridiculous. And we need to stop the madness. Stop. Focus. Focus. Come back and focus. You know? And these are people I actually have a lot of respect for. I watch them on a daily basis. You know, to combine my, you know, research and my own due diligence that I have done to report to you guys. But at the same time, it is so crazy that they stop one coin, promoting another coin. I know the viewers slash the subscribers are not in a position to say screaming and say stop you are confusing me focus in one coin this coin that coin but not too many coins at once so since i have the voice i have the channel to speak for uh, you know and in, in behalf of some of the youtuber uh, uh, subscribers forgive me uh, I'm, I'm all i'm at work i'm on my break so i'm trying to bring this to you guys so since i can bring how you guys must be feeling because i'm feeling the same way i turn on youtube this new coin come and they say this is the next ship this is the next pepe why does it have to be the next ship the next pepe can it just be the coin period we are not looking for the next ship the next pepe we are trying to build strong communities and see if those coins can get to one penny. If we just drop and drop and drop in them like that, we'll never get to one penny dream that we are hoping for. Again, let's all get together, have this uh, petition to have Coinbase and Robinhood list Pepe. Then we could see, we could make some money from there. But we cannot, again, stop the madness. We cannot be jumping one coin to the other. Enough is enough. Stop. Subscribe and please let me know how you feel. I'm not being ridiculous. I'm not being crazy. But as an investor, as a viewer, as a subscriber, I feel the pain for everybody else who's watching. We cannot keep up with the new coins. Every five seconds, a new coin being created. Stop. Subscribe. Bye.